What's up everybody? We are in Caldwell, Idaho. We have made it into the hundredth year. Uh, this year is the big 100th for Caldwell, so it's uh, pretty neat to get to be a part of the hundredth year. So, what do you what do you think about it? I mean, you said it. It's the hundredth year. It's hard to think they've been doing this for 100 years. I mean, I'm 52, and just to think they've been doing it twice as you know twice that long is yeah. uh, pretty pretty humbling to be asked to be here on their hundred. Yeah, year. it's a big deal. I mean, it's I don't know to hundred years of rodeo. That's that's pretty special, dude. Yeah, not, uh, there's not a lot of museum, you know, come up from time to time, and but there's not a whole lot of PRC rodeos that's been going for a hundred or over a hundred years, and so I, I really don't it's have. Cool to be a part of it, yeah, ain't it? Yeah, you just think all the cowboys and cowgirls been here before us, and now we get to be in their arena and putting on the show for them. So. Where Where have you been since Cheyenne? Ah, uh, man, from Cheyenne. And from Cheyenne, I got to go home for about four or five days and look at my lucky, yard. Lucky dog. And, lucky. But I looked at my yard. My mower wouldn't start. I was out of gas in the weed eater. I mean, it, nothing was working. My air conditioner was broke. So I was glad to get on a plane and come back to, to Caldwell. So where did, where did you go from Cheyenne? You... I go from Cheyenne to here. I would started my July I thought, run. I thought you did a... Uh... Oh, I went to Dalhart. Dalhart, yeah, where they had all the storms. Yeah, Dalhart, Texas. I went from Cheyenne to Dalhart and then home. I'm sorry. And then home. Yeah. So this, you haven't been anywhere since Dalhart. No, no, no. Just right. Harp, where have you been? You went, uh, what? Uh, Selena, Cheyenne, Joseph, Loveland, Lawton. Here. Yeah, so you're, you've been burning up the trail too. Yeah. We all have been burning up the trail. It's uh, kind of one of them... I don't know, I guess, I guess what you call is that time of the season. Uh, yeah. I don't know, it feels like that's all we're doing is just grinding it out right now. But uh, I kind of updated everybody just a day or two ago, you know, Smash and I left Sykes, Missouri, ended up driving all night from Sykes into the W, got to the W and it rained six inches of rain, so. Uh, lots and lots of water filled up the ponds. Thank the Lord for that. And did a little laundry, got rocking and rolling again, and got the trailer unpacked and ended up catching a flight. Met with Nathan, went from Oklahoma City to Denver, Denver to Boise, Boise, which is where Sosby picked us up. And then we started here on Tuesday. Tonight is Thursday, so we're getting ready for performance number three. Rode some buckers. Uh, Parker Bredding last night made one heck of a bull ride. Jace Tross Claire. Uh, who else? So those Wacy Shalla. Wacy Trace or Jace uh, Scooby. Yeah, uh, Jace Tross Claire. So I don't they, know. They've they rode, rode three or four or five, but then the ones they rode have been bucking some of the guys. But it's been. Kind of, I don't know, last night we had 15 guys on the list, ended up only bucking six bulls. So it's definitely, it's definitely getting late in August. Everybody is guys are tore up. battered, yeah. bruised, sore. But, uh, you know, there's, I think maybe just uh, the rest of this month and then we get through September, September 30 is the cutoff for the 2024 season to see who makes the cut for the NFR. So. Uh, things are getting down to the down to the cutting they say you know <laughs> uh, guys that are on the bubble guys that are having a hard time getting the ball rolling they're running out of time because it ain't gonna be long and the the season will be over but nonetheless just wanted to kind of update everybody you know we are here at Caldwell got the crew back together getting the band ready to roll Sosby's in the house working with Nathan Harp. Powder River Rodeo. Crowd sold out tonight, tomorrow night. Sold out crowd every night. Yeah. So cool. Uh, if you've never been to the Caldwell Night Rodeo, I don't know what you're waiting on, but it is one hell of a party. So uh, just a little update. Wanted to get everybody updated, you know. Hope everybody's enjoying these, following along. Comment below. Uh, if you've been out rodeoing, where have you been? If you've been the fans sitting at home watching us on the Cowboy Channel, comment below which rodeos you guys have been watching because 
I don't know about you, so, but I feel like for the 100 days of rodeo, we've been almost to all 100 days of the rodeo. <laughs> it feels so like it. It feels like it, man. Man, it it's a summer. It's the it's a summer grind, but I kind of feel like I'm starting to catch my second wind a little right, bit. Right, right, and you do. You know, we're we're fortunate and stuff. To everybody's healthy, and you know, we're feeling good. And, and uh, you know, it gets hot right there through July, but you get here, oh, it it's gets well. It gets warm. They said Saturday it's going to be in the like 105 and stuff here. So that's like, like that's like Oklahoma. I know it. Charleston, I know it. Arkansas. I know it. Kind of heat. Yeah, yeah, it's like back home stuff. So we can handle it. We can make sure handle it. And like I say, sell out crowds and stuff. Sorry about that. I guess it's a brew mine. Never used one. But uh, sell out crowds is what I'm pumped about here. They they've been sold out for months and months ahead of time for the hundred celebration, and I'm pumped to get out there and get be in the middle of it. I'm just I'm excited to. Uh, I don't know what keeps coming to my mind is finish strong. You know we're. We're winding down, like I said, uh, end of the season is coming for Pro Rodeo. Gonna get back on tour with the PBR, so everybody that's been commenting, wondering where I'm at, uh, for all the PBRs that's been going on, it's just a schedule conflict, so, uh, you know, I've gotta go, gotta go where I gave my word, and uh, so we've been rodeoing. We're getting through the rodeo season, head back to Austin's PBR next week, uh from austin's pbr next week back up to the great ellensburg washington uh rodeo from ellensburg back to kansas city pbr from kansas city pbr and that one's going to be a little bit crazy because kansas city pbr is friday saturday sunday and then we have a midnight flight from kansas city going to boise and then renting a car driving to pendleton to be at pendleton's extreme bulls monday tuesday and then Pendleton Rodeo, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So that'll be uh, nine, nine or ten performances all jumbled up back to back. Hopefully, good Lord willing, flights go good and we can get there. But uh, music's changing, so I'm going to go ahead and throw on my jersey, get some cleats on, and get ready for the rodeo here at Caldwell, Idaho. Uh, comment below. Let us know what you think. Hope you guys are doing well. God bless you. And uh, see you soon.